I bought this radio uh, yesterday, <coughs> but um, it is one of those Bluetooth speakers, a very cheap radio. Um, it's a Dixon, but you get so l lot of these uh, types of radios, but they all have the same thing in mind. It's, they, um, it's like a small box and there's a, U, uh, a Bluetooth connection. You uh, can maybe play music on your phone through this radio. Then it's a very simple uh, few buttons for the music um, to program the unit and normally there's uh, the, the charging port and a USB if you want to play MP4 music and then it's a place for a, a memory card and an auxiliary in that you can maybe take a microphone and speak to through it. But this unit has a problem. If you switch it on it makes a very big noise. It starts at Bluetooth mode. The volume is maximum. But this is a the issue. If you wanna in your use this in your office, maybe if you want to listen to radio, and the moment you switch it on, it make one hell of a noise, and this is gonna wake up everybody. I'll show you when the this thing is off, and I'm gonna put it on now and just listen what's happening. Bluetooth mode. And now the volume is very low. So this is, you don't want that Bluetooth mode, that high volume. And then you can put FM the... FM radio mode. And then you put it in the radio mode, the first Bluetooth to start with this. And then it goes to the Bluetooth mode, for whatever modes there is. But the volume is almost also very high. All right, uh, but I think I need to modify this unit. Um, uh, I want when I before before I switch it on, I want I'm going to put the volume uh, potentiometer I think in here. Switch take off the volume, and then I'm going to switch it on. And after this modes, and then you can adjust the volume for low. And then, but there's another problem if you uh, switch the volume on. It is the first setting is a little bit. If you want a small music in the background, it's too loud already. The moment the next one is off, then you don't hear anything. So, uh, this is how you... I think it only has one music station now, it's an African station. Okay, but what I'm going to do, let's open the unit and uh, see what we can do. I can somewhat quickly explain to you. See what is inside here, and there's the back is a hole where the the air can comes out when the for the <coughs> the speaker the um, cone can move freely. There is no trap of of, of air inside there. They just open here quickly. <coughs> it's amazing how they can make this thing for only 149 South African rand, and there's like two middle men in the in the middle <coughs> everybody makes a cut so let me just okay so here's the back let's open it yeah you can see let's see what's happening here so it's very much about nothing inside here here's your lithium battery this is a normal battery that i bought from the china shop 3.7 volt it's the most regular size uh, one speaker and only one PCB. There's your antenna and there's a button. So there's nothing really inside here. There's only one PCB where everything plugs in. But what I'm going to do, <clears throat> I need to put this volume control somewhere in here just to that we can uh, adjust the volume a little bit before I switch it on. But I need the space that I can put it. But I'm going to tell you, so much show you on this paper what I'm going to do here. <clears throat> if you, this is a speaker wise, uh, old radios, when there's like different boards, there's a preamp, main amp, then you can put a potentiometer in to uh, lower the input of the main amp through a potentiometer. But this is different. You can't work here. There's just, it's nothing you learn. Everything is in once here. The only thing what I can do is to take the output for the speakers 
and uh, put it through here's your speaker and i'm going to put this potentiometer on the wires here and then i'm going <clears> to <throat> this is the ground and then as you select a little bit higher then you can have more music or louder and softer when you have a minimum adjustment then you actually short out the the, the um the speaker without you know, the higher the more resistance and the more it gets of the input here but this must be very low because this ohm value of this speaker is say for less four and uh, four ohm and then you have to put a very like a uh, say maybe a 50, 50 ohm speak that uh, year or a 10 ohm but i don't have the lowest i can can get around here so it's a 500 ohm but then what happened then very on the end it will start uh, controlling the volume to a listenable and down here you will feel you will hear nothing um uh, okay but the, another thing is you have to put in another resistor here in line should you have then a four ohm over your this potentiometer then you half the ohm value so then it can maybe damage the output of your of your uh, amplifier so then what you do is you know, just for safety put a 10 ohm i put the two 10 ohm resistors is then five ohm so just to protect the circuit of the radio so that you have at least four ohms always in the in the output so that you don't blow it all right now um, what i'm gonna do first i think we first wants to test it i'm gonna just desolder the wire here and just uh, connect the potentiometer in here and uh, just to see what we what we're dealing with here Okay, let's switch it on a minimum. So now there's this safe, the output of through the four, five ohms, so it's like, like a speaker, they won't affect anything. Let's switch it on. Bluetooth mode. Now let's switch it off again. Let's switch it on. So that is more like it. The, the, the direction is just a little bit. They just get a station, yeah? I'm just going to quickly. Okay, right. I, I found a better station, yeah? But now you can see what's happening. Now you, the volume. Must maximum and there's low. So you can put it there in low. You can hear. Now you can have a little bit of music in the background in the office. Now let's switch it off and see what is the the case here. It's very slowly, really sudden, sudden or subtle. And then you have the mode. There's your music, and you can just. This works perfectly, perfectly. So this is a 500 ohm resistor, like a potentiometer, and a 10 ohm, two 10 ohms, like a 5 ohm. So this is an RGB light. Look at the light. If you if you put the mode button in, then it kills that light. So the RGB, you just bounce against ricochet against the speaker cone and makes this effect and then if you put it back in you just keep the mode in and then it goes back rgb red green and blue was the meaning of and then they by switching those three leds the colors then they differ between the three colors um, but there's only two wires i don't know how they do this normally it's got three wires or maybe uh, some of the stuff gets so small um, you get this little chip in there that they communicate with with some sort of protocol and then it switches the lights up and down or maybe a voltage a threshold different thresholds switch the different colors 
Um, Oké, okay, this is a, now the next shop, uh, effort is now, I'm gonna mark the ground, but this is the, as I say, the pot's the wrong way around now, look. It's supposed to volume up, other side is, then we're gonna, this must be my ground, I'm gonna mark it here, that's gonna be the one that goes there. Okay, let's, uh, I'll just fast forward the effort here, while I'm doing it, and then, uh, then I don't have to talk. Okay, let's test it. We switch it on with the volume down. What you got here is you got your DB box right next to your pump box. It's perfectly so low volume. <coughs> okay, now let's just gonna quickly fasten this screw here okay I'm going to close it now so everything looks okay yeah Obviously, there's a charger inside here, yeah, the 5 volt, and then there's a battery management chip that organized the, the lithium battery. So it's nice, you know, you can just put your finger like this, volume low, switch on. And then your radio. And it might make things easier. I don't know why the people in the way are, are they that much on the With the low volume. Okay, that's perfect. Let's just switch and put then the screws back. So there's your radio. Let's for the last time put the volume down. Uh, switch it on. Just wait a while. Put put a little volume a little bit higher. Then your radio mode. End of yesterday's Ryder Cup golf in Rome, Northern Ireland's Rory McIlroy was involved in a row with an. So now you you can also now maybe USA then Europe if you need higher volume then put the volume higher. Uh, move aside, it was in his line of vision. He stood there. But you don't need such a unless you want to play music or something. Continue to wave the hat. So I think Rory. Europe need just four points from today's 12 singles matches to regain the trophy. And, and there goes the volume a little bit lower. But I think let's leave it as it is. And loud and then you can adjust the volume here. Okay, that works perfectly. So um, that was one modification of a Chinese Dixon radio Bluetooth radio uh, if it irritates you the volume is too loud then you can do like this modification you can just put a knob on here maybe just to make it neat but i think that is okay okay i hope you enjoy this video it makes sense to you for those who can maybe do it till next time cheers